Recently, we've seen an attack on women's health, rights, and economic security. And women and families have paid the price, especially women of color, who have never had a fair shot. Instead of passing policies that help women, the Trump administration has relentlessly tried to take away our health care. And now Trump wants to jam through a Supreme Court nominee who will dismantle the Affordable Care Act and overturn Roe v. Wade. Without the ACA, nearly 68 million women and girls could again be denied or priced out of coverage. Insurance companies would be allowed to charge women more just for being women. And if taking away your health care and reproductive freedom during a deadly pandemic and economic crisis isn't enough, the Trump administration is also the worst administration for women's economic security. Since the beginning of this administration, women have lost more than 2 million jobs, the worst record compared to every previous president since 1964. The Trump administration has stalled equal pay, passed tax cuts for the wealthiest Americans while blocking overtime, and failed to raise the minimum wage. Women are central to our nation's success. We need the federal government to advance an agenda that allows women and their families to thrive. Women's lives and futures are on the line. 